Hello guys, in this lecture, I am going to teach you how to draw a signal flow graph from the block diagram. So in the previous classes, we discussed about how to solve a transfer function from the block diagram by using block reduction techniques. There is another technique to find the transfer function of a system that is Mason's gain formula. Mason's S.J. Masons, he said that uh, instead of a reduction technique, we can use a formula that is designed by S.J. Masons. So, but to use the formula, we need a signal flow graph. So, for that purpose only, we have to learn the conversion from block diagram to signal flow graph. After that, we will see the how to find the transfer function from the signal flow graph with a simple formula. See here in the slide, this is a block diagram block diagram consists input signal output signal error signal feedback signal so if we have a block and summing point and all these components then how to draw a signal flow graph for this block diagram okay so we have to replace the blocks or branches everything with a single line that is called a branch so in the place of nodes or junctions, we have to maintain the nodes. See here from the input signal, there is a summing point which is combining the signals, input signal and feedback signal. So there is a node, it forms a node. So we have to maintain a node. This node consists two inputs from signal R input and feedback signal H input. After that, there is a gain block. So we have to replace this gain block with a single line that is a branch. This branch gain is G. We have to simply write it G only. If we have gain blocks, feedback gain blocks, change the branch to replace it. The branch ki signal flow direction maintain it. Arrows says that the signal flow path. Okay, branch ki signal flow uh, path in create the signal flow path. Then the gain value maintain maintain it. Okay, this is very simple. We can draw the signal flow graph for any block diagram by replacing the gain blocks with a branch and junction points with the nodes. So signal flow graph consists of only branches and nodes only. Okay, every branch ki one value ni just gain values na draw kun sir See here now we will draw a signal flow graph for, for this block diagram. So this block diagram ko pur signal flow graph draw chadam, right? So take input R of S. After that summing point, agar node form chhendi. Our node nun chi next summing point okay so madhilo g1 gain right yala rai andi ikkada gain value 1 input r of s after that summing point x2 ondhi kada andi x2 tharavata g2 okay summing point tharavata in chastham andi g2 okay summing point tharavata next junction x3 node junction then gain value g2 rai andi Next simple G3 ni go node form chase koni G3 gain dry and after that output CFS. You put feedback forms feedback paths in connect chain. Okay, G2 Munduna node the gar key work signal driver. E signal according chi after G3. Flow direction maintain chain. This is minus H3 because minus signal is connected. Negative signal is connected. Next, E H2 in chi G1 key. Okay, this is minus H1 feedback. H2 feedback and G3, G2 node. Akkad nunchi input node connect shell. G1 mundan node ki. This is minus H2. Okay, right. That's it. This is the signal flow graph for this block diagram. If you want to check this is right or wrong, see here in the below is the right answer. So, this example shown the block signal flow graph draw chain. Very easy. Now, Move to the summing point RFS input is connected to the summing point in game value 1. After the summing point that is G1 is summing point of signal, negative signal. After that, another summing point that is G2. Next one G3. This is X1, this is X2. After G3, X3. After that, G4. After that, final one output CFS. Now at the feedback loops. Okay, output in Chi direct to first one to Chi minus X3. Next one, X3 point in Chi, X1 point. Key. This is minus H2. Now output to the X2. 
it is minus h1 that's it this is a simple one block diagram signal flow graph draw cheyadam okay signal flow graph nunchi manam masons gain formula use cheskoni taniki transfer function find cheyadam okay adi next class lo discuss cheyadam now check the answer this is the answer now i will give you an example okay just for practice purpose draw the signal flow graph for the above block diagram okay if you have any doubt please comment in the comment box regarding the signal flow graphs uh, we will see you in the next class thank you guys thanks for watching this video